According to the U.S. Geological Survey's Did You Feel It map, the 5.1 quake on the Fisher and Scurry County line was felt as far south as San Antonio, as far north as Amarillo and southern Oklahoma, and all over DFW. People from Carrollton to Irving to Allen telling us on social media that they felt it too. Geologist Peter Hennings is not surprised. And it comes at the end of a week where we've seen a a number of of other large earthquakes in this exact same area. A series of smaller quakes have hit the same area since July. The 5.1 quake, the largest in recent memory, followed by a series of smaller aftershocks. So this is a very active earthquake cluster, uh, and it's something that's caught uh, our, our attentions. I know it's caught the attention of the oil and gas regulator, the the Texas Railroad Commission, and um, and folks may have some concern. Because the Texas Railroad Commission has been tracking the relationship between saltwater disposal wells and earthquakes for more than a decade, regulating where and how deep wastewater from oil field operations can be injected back into the ground. Working with operators to have those operators change their injection practices in this specific area to try to um, reduce the number of earthquakes because the earthquakes in this area have been happening uh, since uh, the beginning of 2020. Meanwhile, the problem's serious enough that Scurry County Judge Dan Hicks issued a disaster declaration on Friday after he says the county has been rattled by 61 earthquakes in just the past week, asking residents to report any and all damage they find. Rattled nerves and the debate over the possible cause, the only damage reported so far. In Dallas, I'm Kevin Reese.